have managed to show you some of the practicals that we can actually do here. Um, I'm really sorry you can't be with us today, but I will, I'm here to try and answer as many questions as I possibly can regarding signs that anybody has. So I'll start off. Has anybody got any questions they'd like to ask um, before I go through a little bit of information that um, I've got here? One of the questions we've had, Mrs. Bashir, is how does science at Hartman Central High School differ from science in primary school? Okay, so um, at Blackburn Central High School, we pride ourselves on the facilities that we have here. So we have um, six labs here. Well, we have five labs and one classroom, which we also use within the science department. So we've got three fully functioning labs here. Um, we also have two service labs, which basically has the amenities on the side. So we have gas and we have water available um, for the students to use um, when we're doing practicals. Um, so one of the ways it actually differs from primary school is the practicals that we do within in primary school you, you try they try and accommodate the basic science that you have about um, the world around you but at Blackburn Central High School um, what, one of the things we try and to do, to do is actually basically um, explain the science of the real world and we, 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 do, we try to do as many practicals as we can to show you how the science is linked to, to the world around you um, so that's something that we do and unfortunately you know it's a shame you can't be here because you know we have some some lovely practicals that obviously uh, we could show you but when you're here we can we can have a chance to show you all those okay right so I'll explain what we what we basically do here so at key stage three um, we divide our key stage three course over 20 topics that we have um, and those courses so I'll just show you some of the books that we have okay so we have um, a book one and a book two so this is what we basically use with the key stage, um, key stage three. And um, so the, some of the some of the things that we we have here is we, we try and show you the sciences of the sun and the space around you, chemical reactions. We have we learn about plants, we learn about the earth, we learn about the human body, magnets, electricity, light, um, and sound and acids and alkalis. They're just some of the topics that we basically do. So it's a little bit what you do at primary school, but we do a lot more and we do a lot more practical. So we really do hope that you know it entices you to become scientists of the future and get and a career um, in, in a science career when you when you move on after school. Um, at Key Stage 4, uh, we offer a combined science trilogy. We follow the AQA um, examination um, and we do triple science as well. So we also offer that. So that's something that we do offer, which you know not all schools offer that. Um, we promote learning, obviously, like I said, through real life science. Um, we have we've got some revision guides with some question booklets. We have some cards, which I'll just show you as well. Okay, so these are all the cards, the flashcards. So we do have a lot of resources available here that obviously assist the learning um, at Key Stage 4 and also Key Stage 3. Anybody got any other questions for me? That's fabulous. Thank you very much. Okay, fabulous. Thank, thank, you. thank you very much. Thank you for watching.